Welcome, welcome, welcome to another episode of Super Shopper. Now hold on, I will give you your host Pratibha Raman back. But before that, there's still half an hour of shopping left with me because she just decided to extend her vacation a little bit. So I was wondering what to shop for in this particular episode because you know what, I don't want to step outside and buy some pink shoes and leather bags. And then I decided I'll come to Tirwan Mayur. Now this place, Tirwan Mayur, is the place for all the bachelors because of its proximity to all the IT hubs. And I came here as a bachelor myself some six months back, but I was clueless where to go and shop for my essentials. That's exactly what this show is about. I will tell you where you can go in Tirwan Mayur to shop for your essentials as a bachelor and get a value for your money. Next half an hour of Super Shopper is all about that, the bachelor special. Some say cleanliness is next to godliness. Well, for most bachelors, cleaning is a bit of a waste of time. But then comes the day, the day that mom decides to visit. And of course, we've got to deceive our mothers into believing we are useful, productive, clean members of the society. So here we are. Now, in a place like Tiran Mule, you'd find absolutely hundreds of apartments and more than that are provision stores like these where uh, your first basic necessity would be met. That is rooms and mops and buckets and all of that. Now, no matter how small your room is and no matter how lazy you are, this is one painful job to clean up your room, to clean up your house. So you need to buy these essentials and you can visit any provision store to buy this. Now, if you are an averagely clean person like me and you can make do with uh, one bucket and probably one room or something, you won't spend much. But if you are a cleanliness freak, then you, you get attracted to colors and the assortment of cleaning items at your disposal, then you would end up spending easily some 300 to 400. But the point here is that you would find these kind of things at any provision store. But what we are going to search for in the first segment today are mattresses and bed, bed sheets and pillows and all of that. Because that is very difficult to find here in Tiran Mule. So I'm going to go out and search for a shop that gives me all of that. And let me find out what is the minimum budget that I can allot to something like that. One of the most important, unmistakably important uh, landmark here in Tirwanmi is the RTO. Now most of these bachelors choose to stay in this place nearby RTO or say Kotiwakam. And that's why all these businesses have also decided to concentrate in and around this place. So I was, I was searching for a place that would sell mattresses and pillows and, and bed sheets and all of that. I have bumped into this place called Fatima Bedding Store which has a very good collection of pillows and from what, what looks from outside. It has a very good collection of pillows and bed sheets. I'm going to go inside and find out if I can fit that in my budget. Curlon uses vertical compression technology to give more spring action to the coil in the mattresses. In other words, burns holes in a bachelor's pockets. But rarely any single guy would go for an investment of 5,000 rupees on a mattress. What you should go for instead are the cotton ones. I have stayed outside my home for the past six or seven years now and these things, these mattresses have, have been the only companion that I've had sticking with me throughout. I remember when I was in college, after every semester we'd go back home and we'll dump all our luggage, all the mattresses and everything in a huge storeroom. When we'll come back after the holidays, we'd head towards the storeroom to pick out the best of the lot, to pick out the best mattress of the lot so that we have it for the rest of the year. I know that's not a very proud thing to do, which is why you can't do that when you're a professional. That's why you need to come to these kind of stores and pick out the best mattress that you find for yourself. I have here with me Akhtar, Mr. Akhtar Hussain. Uh, Mr. Akhtar Hussain will tell us about the mattresses, about the collection that they have here. Sir, where do you make all this? Do you make it here or do you make it here? No, it's a factory in Bangalore. Bangalore, yeah. It's a factory in Bangalore. It's a factory from Bangalore. It's a factory from Bangalore. It's a factory from Bangalore. Okay, so do you make all of this from Bangalore? Do you make all of this from Bangalore? Yes, it's a factory from Bangalore. 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 इसमें क्या डिफरेंस है ये क्यों बैठे हैं इसमें कुछ क्वालिटी का अंदर बैठे हैं क्वालिटी है इसमें ये पूरा रबरिस्ट कायर है इसमें आता है 65 डेंसिटी रबरिस्ट कायर बाद में थोड़ा से 15 एमएम में तो इसके अंदर रबर है हाँ रबरिस्ट कायर अच्छा कोयल जो है कायर है उसको रबर मिक्स करके रबरिस्ट प्रेसिंग करता है कंप्रेसिंग 
इसका दाम आ रहा है थ्री थाउजेंड सिक्सटीन रुपीज थ्री थाउजेंड सिक्सटीन रुपीज At Fatima Bedding Mart, you can also sell your old mattresses or give them a facelift. अच्छा क्वालिटी चाहिए तो आपको सेवन सेवेंटी फाइव में है और चौदह सिक्स फिफ्टी में है बहुत क्वालिटी है इसमें आपको प्योर काटन है ये सो द बेड स्प्रेड हियर इज अबाउट सिक्स हंड्रेड सेवन हंड्रेड रुपीज इट रेंज इज फ्रॉम सिक्स हंड्रेड टू अबाउट से वन थाउजेंड टू हंड्रेड सो लेट मी जस्ट डू अ बिट ऑफ क्विक मैथ नाउ इफ आई गो फॉर द बेस्ट ऑप्शन अवेलेबल इन द स्टोर इफ आई गो फॉर कर्ल ऑन मैट्रेस कपल विद दिस बेड स्प्रेड मे बी कपल ऑफ पिलोज द एंटायर बजट वुड कम्फर्टेबली सेटल इन विद इन फाइव थाउजेंड विच इज़ अ वेरी गुड इन्वेस्टमेंट फॉर इट इट्स वन टाइम इन्वेस्टमेंट इन स्टे विथ यू बट लेट मी ऑल्सो टेल यू दैट देर चीपर ऑप्शन अवेलेबल So the curl on mattresses would be yours at a price of three thousand to four thousand, yeah. Thanks to all the principle of springs and coils and all that. But have you ever noticed why all the curl on advertisements have a happy couple on the bed? That's because who are we kidding? The curl on mattresses are not for bachelors. That's too high on the budget, and the budget is one factor which determines what a bachelor buys. That's why I'll show you a mattress which is not branded as such. But it has the same funda. It has the same spring and coil funda. It's a bit cheaper. It'll come to you for about two thousand five hundred rupees. If you think even that is a bit too much, which I personally also think, you can go for an out-and-out -out cotton mattress, which would be yours for a price range of say 250 to 500. This out-and-out -out cotton, it would wear out sooner, but then it's okay. It's easier on the budget. But forget everything. If you don't want to spend anything more than 100, let me give you an idea. There's this thing, which would be all yours in less than 100. It's just 700 rupees, and it's so much fun just having a cup of tea with your friends sitting on this. That was all about the beds and mattresses here in Chennai. But if you're a bachelor who just stepped into Chennai, especially from the north, then your biggest headache would not be finding a pillow and a mattress. Your biggest headache would be food. There'd be times where you'd be staying alone and wishing that you had some utensils to yourself, maybe a stove or two, where you could cook something on your own. Now, where in Tiruvannamur would you go to buy some utensils? Let me show you. If you enter the shop without a specific goal in mind, you would be lost in a sea of options. Men and kitchen utensils hasn't really been a winning combination in the past. So let me narrow it down a bit. It's a long, long, long search for a shop that would sell something that you can make your food in. Uh, it was long search, but I finally found this place called Dhan Lakshmi Metals, which has a very good collection. But it is not exactly in Tiruvannamur. It's a bit far from Tiruvannamur. It's in a place called Nilangarai. Uh, but the good thing about this shop is that it has a very good collection. For example, these things where you can uh, you can use them to peel your vegetables and all that. But this is all for the housewives, really. I mean, uh, considering you guys are bachelors, you would not need these things for at least five or six years from now. What you would need, by the way, are these things. These are pet bottles. Uh, this one is has roses on it. So I'm not going to show you this. Pet bottles here, which are very. Cheap. These are priced at about thirty, thirty, thirty-five, twenty-five, and you would also need pet jars to keep your food items preserved. But the thing that we are concentrating on in this particular segment, in this particular shop, is that uh, we are trying to find vessels where you can make some food, you can cook some homemade food, right? So I'm going to go in and take a look at all the vessels, and my thumbnail is actually bad, so I, it'll be a little difficult. It'll be a bit of hard work for me to actually figure out the vessels where I can make some homemade food. Let's see if I succeed in that. Let's start with the morning. It's not a big surprise that Dhan Lakshmi Metals, like any other shop in Chennai that sells utensils, would take care of your caffeine needs. 
tumblers of various sizes and shapes and also containers to store traditional Tamil preparations like mohr. However, if you are a bachelor who doesn't belong to this part of the country, then you would need something to make yourself a few hot rotis with steaming dal. We are here for 19 years. We are coming to the bachelor. We are coming to the cooker, the industry stuff. We are coming to the tumbler, the pot. Dolly Bachelors, check this out. Now, these things are the life saving drugs of your single life here in Chennai. Okay? Things like these, like the iron box and all of that. So, let me cut the business short for you. Let me tell you. Uh, see, what happens is when you go to an unknown place and you walk into a store like this, you would be absolutely clueless what to buy because there's just so many things around you, you wouldn't know what to buy. So, I'll give you a few tips. The first thing that you need to buy is an induction stuff. Right, so all you need to do is just plug it in. You can cook whatever you want. You can make a dosa, or if you want to have a bit of not only dinner, you can make a roti for yourself as well. With that, if you are not very familiar with Tamil and if you're not a big fan of the sign language, let me tell you these things. Which I don't know what the English word for this is. I'm pretty sure here a lot of people would not understand. Communication would be difficult for you. So the Tamil word for things like these is karandi, that's what I've been told, right? And these things would be yours in about, what, 20, 25 rupees, that's not a big investment at all. The biggest investment would be the induction stove and a very useful investment. For that, you need to invest about 2,500 rupees to get an induction stove. With that, you need to buy a couple of vessels to cook your food in. These things would not cost you more than 200. So my verdict is that after you have your bed and your mattress ready at your place, just make a decent investment of about 3,000 or something, get these products done, and then you would never ever complain about food in Chennai. It's 1.30 in the afternoon here, and talking of mattresses and induction stuffs, I'm guessing the tiredness and the hunger is clear on my face. So I'll take a very short break. There's still loads of shopping left. You guys join me after a very small break.